I'm Paul Franklin and I am the director. The great thing about this technology is that it allows us to basically put imagery up so we can create backdrops and worlds and environments. But because they're on LED screens, it's also lighting the set and it produces a much more convincing and realistic result. The rest of the crew can also see what's going on. We all understand that we're working towards a common goal. Rather than it just being purely a technical exercise, you can, you can be part of that creative story. I'm Dale Elena McCready, I'm a cinematographer. Shooting on the virtual stage is quite amazing as a DOP because I've shot a lot of uh, rear projection and green screen over the years, like visual effects work. And having this huge screen of lighting is the one thing that you don't get in those situations. It inherently looks more real straight away because they're, they're in that place. It overall brings the sense of realism to the situation. I'm Rachel and I'm an actor on set. When I have done green screen in the past, it's very different because you have to imagine what you're looking at, whereas here it's nice to have the visual. It's really, really important as an actor. My name's Tatiana and I've been working as an art assistant. You can have a virtual painting. As soon as it's virtual, it can get bigger, it can get smaller, and that freedom is, is something extraordinary. You have more control. My name's Mark Gillespie and I was the first AD. The main experience I've come away with is the durability of the day. One of the scenarios that we did was on a rooftop and it allowed us to maintain a magic hour all day, which you know, if we had it probably done on any other production, that would maybe be a five day shoot, so we compressed that into one day. You can shoot incredibly quickly and we would, you know, in the last two hours of one shoot day, we turned over 12 times. The locations are instant, you know, some days we moved three or four times within a day. It really is game changing.